Dozens of people in southern Kentucky spending the holiday weekend cleaning up. Flash flooding last night in Wayne County damaged some cars and even knocked a home off its foundation. Phil Pendleton takes a look at the damage. The creek below Connie Foster's Wayne County home is, well, just a creek, but Thursday afternoon it became a river. It had just come a real good hard downpour and rain. Enough water to pick up cars and trailers and toss them around like matchbox cars. And the next thing I know, cars hit this trailer, knocked the trailer into the side of hers, and just shoved it all into the tree. Her daughter's home is a total loss. She doesn't have insurance. All I could worry about is how close she came to being pinned in there. The emergency management director says the Highway 167 area received more than two inches of rain. And so it was just one big lake. Don Bertram says that came down in less than 30 minutes. During a normal rainfall, the water would come out of these hills over here to my right and would settle into this cave down here just to my left. But yesterday, that cave. All that rain was simply too much. It collected and it then came down into here. It didn't take long then for all of that rainwater to cover this field and then get into several of the homes. Property owners tell me they still don't know how much damage was done. Clean truck loads. Bertram fears there's probably more damage under the house than in it. There's going to be a lot of cleanup. All the water's gone now, leaving a lot of debris and questions of where some will now live. She'll stay with me. We'll try to figure something out. In Wayne County, Phil Pendleton, WKYT. The emergency management director says they also received a report of a small sinkhole opening on Kendrick Avenue in Monticello, but the weather caused no other major structural damage.